somebody up front said it, this car. That's my favorite, the 1946 Ford Convertible. Well, notice we have several of our most famous picture cars here, but of course we can't talk about picture cars without talking about our most famous picture car series, which is of course Fast and the Furious. Do I have any Fast and the Furious fans? Yeah. All right. So I'm sure you guys are aware that Fate of the Furious is coming out very soon. Is everyone ready? Fantastic. You also may have noticed that we sat, excuse me, passed the gyrosphere from Jurassic Park back there. Now, for those of you who have seen the movie, there was a glass dome that encircled the entire thing, and the cool thing is that glass dome wasn't actually there the entire time. It was digitally inserted so that we didn't have to worry about any camera reflections. Now, ladies and gentlemen, like I said, that was the driver's fear. This is another car from Jurassic Park. These are all clues that we are entering Jurassic Park. Now, I could say welcome to Jurassic Park, but why would I say it when he could say it so much better? Well... To Jurassic Park. See? So much better than me, right? Ladies and gentlemen, this is our Jurassic Park area. This is where we have some of the props and the dinosaurs from Jurassic Park. We like to keep the dinosaurs around the props from the movies that they shot in because they grew up with the movies and it makes them feel a little more comfortable. And it is easier for us to store them here on property because they are probably being fed. This is why the cages are broken open. Um, oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, they weren't they weren't being fed. They were, they just escaped. You alright back there, third car? Okay, back there. All right, ladies and gentlemen. That was, of course, an illusion. Those, of course, weren't real dinosaurs. It's okay. You can breathe now. They weren't real. That was just one of the several illusions we have to create. Another illusion we have to create is, of course, weather, ladies and gentlemen. And it is hard for us to create weather in California because it never rains. It's a desert. Who better to talk about weather than the weatherman himself? Hi, everybody. Here's today's forecast for the Universal Backlog. It's going to be sunny and dry in Six Points, Texas. Cool and cloudy in New York. Expect snow and sleep on New York Street. And we've got a high chance of fine precipitation for Skull Island, Amity Island, and Island of the Dry. That's your forecast for today. Now here's a look at what's going on in your neck. We're right in the middle of it. We're trying to be a flashlight, folks. This is a very controlled environment. This is where, like I said, we create our weather effects. Now, one of the ways we create our effects is we have some pipes that lead to spigots that you see right now. These spigots are aimed right up into the air and shoot the water into the air so they are naturally back down to the earth. You may also notice that these water droplets are a little bit bigger than they would be in real life per se. That's how they show up on camera. And of course, if we still have trouble having these water droplets show up on camera, we can mix in a little condensed milk to make them a little less transparent and a little more opaque. So they show up a little better on camera. Probably turn the water off by now. Might be funny. Looks like <laughs> See, this is why. Okay. I should warn you, um, if you're in a blue seat, you might get wet. I don't know if you want to uh, make any changes accordingly to your seating pattern. Sorry about that. Universal loves to spray water at you. <laughs> 